Scientists have discovered almost 4,000 exoplanets since the first one was confirmed orbiting a sunlight star in 1995, according to NASA's Exoplanet Exploration page. Moreover, NASA's Kepler Space Observatory made half of these discoveries, deployed in 2009 to assess how common Earth-like planets are throughout the Milky Way galaxy. Exoplanet's findings have revealed that tiny, rocky worlds like ours are common throughout the cosmos. A planet must be small and thus rocky in orbit in its star's habitable zone to qualify as possibly life-friendly. The habitable zone is informally defined as a position where water can exist in liquid form on a world's surface. Other criteria, such as the planet's atmospheric makeup and how active its parent star is, will be examined when telescope technology improves. Welcome back to Cosmos Observer, where nothing goes unobserved in the universe. While Earth 2.0 is still a mystery, here are some of the closest known analogs to our home planet. Number 1. Kepler 186f This planet is about 10% larger than the size of Earth, yet it looks to be in the habitable zone of its star. Although on its outskirts, Kepler 186f receives only one-third of the energy from its star that Earth receives from the Sun. Because the parent star of Kepler 186f is a red dwarf, the alien world is not a real Earth twin. About 500 light-years from Earth, the planet exists. According to experts, the Kepler 186 star is approximately half the Sun's mass, and the newly discovered planet is far enough away from its star that massive flares may have little effect on it. Long stellar lifespans are also observed in stars like Kepler 186. If Kepler 186f were to orbit the Sun, it would pass through the orbit of Mercury, which is not considered habitable. The planet is still within the habitable zone of Kepler 186 since it's a comparatively cool red dwarf star. According to NASA experts, the star's brightness on the planet's surface at noon is similar to the Sun an hour before nightfall on Earth. Number 2. Gliese 581g This planet is a contentious discovery. It was discovered in 2010, but confirmation has been tough to come by. Even though thousands of exoplanet candidates have been discovered, it usually requires at least two independent observations to determine that these worlds exist. Two separate teams should study the planet using two different observatories to be scientifically rigorous. In 2012, the initial researchers that discovered Gliese 581g in 2010 defended their techniques and questioned the work of some of the other teams. It's no longer listed in at least one well-known exoplanet database. The planet is not currently listed in the Habitable Exoplanets catalog. According to researcher Abel Mendez, the planet does not exist, who described false starts in planetary habitability in an October 2014 blog post. Cleese 581 is still the best possibility for alien life. If confirmed, this rocky world is 20 light years from Earth's sun and two to three times the mass of Earth. The constellation Libra takes roughly 30 days to orbit its parent star, Gliese 581. Number 3. Gliese 667cc Gliese 667cc, another super-Earth, is similarly close by 22 light-years away in the constellation Scorpius. The planet is at least 4.5 times the size of Earth, and its orbit around its parent star takes 28 days. The parent star, GJ 667c, is part of a three-star system. The star is an M-class dwarf star with a mass around one-third that of the Sun. Gliese 667cc was first discovered using the radial velocity approach in a preprint published by the European Southern Observatory's High Accuracy Radial Velocity Planet Searcher HARPS group on November 21, 2011. Researchers from the University of Göttingen and the Carnegie Institution for Science published a peer-reviewed journal study on February 2, 2012, confirming the ESO HARPS group's discovery. Number 4. Kepler 22b 600 light years away is Kepler 22b. It was the first Kepler planet discovered near its parent star's habitable zone. But the world is far larger than Earth, around 2.4 times the size of our planet. There's no way of knowing if this super-Earth planet is rocky, liquid, or gaseous. The 290-day orbit of Kepler 22b is very similar to Earth's 365-day orbit. The exoplanet circles a G-class star similar to our Sun but smaller and cooler. In February 2011, NASA revealed Kepler 22b as one of 54 potential habitable planet candidates. The Kepler Space Telescope discovered all of these planets. The telescope searches for extraterrestrial worlds by detecting dips in the parent star's brightness when the planet passes past. Astronomers confirmed Kepler 22b's existence in December 2011. Scientists published their findings in the Astrophysical Journal. More information on Kepler 22b was revealed during a larger press briefing. NASA stated at the meeting that Kepler has discovered over 1,000 new exoplanet candidates.
Number 5. HD 40307G HD 40307G, a super-Earth, circles its parent star comfortably within the habitable zone. It's located in the constellation Pictor, 42 light-years from Earth. Future telescopes may be able to peek at its surface because it's so close. It orbits its parent star at 56 million miles, barely over half the distance between Earth and the Sun of 93 million miles. Number 6. HD 85512b HD 85512b was discovered in 2011 as part of a group of 50 planets detected by the High Accuracy Radial Velocity Planet Searcher Harps Instrument in Chile. This planet is approximately 3.6 times the mass of Earth. It's located in the constellation Vela the Sail, about 35 light years from Earth's Sun. Researchers are hoping to find out if there is water on the surface one day. Scientists at the University of Geneva in Switzerland discovered HD 85512b. The scientists employ the Doppler spectroscopy technique, which uses minor changes in the parent star's motion to establish the planet's minimal mass. On August 17, 2011, it was discovered. Number 7. Tau Ceti E and Tau Ceti F Tau Ceti E, a planet candidate discovered in December 2012, is only 11.9 light years from Earth. This world is a super Earth with a mass at least 4.3 times that of Earth, depending on its atmosphere. Tau Ceti E could be a slightly heated planet suitable for simple life or a burning world like Venus. Tau Ceti F, like its twin Tau Ceti E, is a super Earth candidate, but it orbits near the edge of Tau Ceti's habitable zone. Tau Ceti F has a mass of at least 6.6 .6 times that of Earth and potentially supports life if its atmosphere holds enough heat. Number 8. Gliese 163c and Gliese 581d The planet Gliese 163c is in the gray zone due to its mass. The planet has a mass 7 times that of Earth, making it a massive rocky planet or a dwarf gas giant. At a distance of 50 light years from Earth, Gliese 163c rolls around its faint planet star every 26 days. The constellation Dorado contains its parent star. According to one analysis, Gliese 581d may have a dense carbon dioxide atmosphere. It circles a red dwarf star and is a sister planet to the potentially habitable Gliese 581g. It is about seven times more massive than Earth. Gliese 581d is about 20 light years away from the Sun, practically in our backyard. Number 9. Kepler 452b According to NASA, this planet is the first near Earth sized planet to orbit a star the size of the Sun discovered in 2015. Kepler 452b is 60 times the size of Earth, and its parent star, Kepler 452, is 10 times the size of the Sun. Kepler 452 orbits in the habitable zone, and it's quite similar to our Sun. Kepler 452b, which is 1.6 times the size of Earth, has a better than even probability of being rocky, according to its discoverers. 1,400 light years from Earth is Kepler 452b. Kepler 452b orbits its star in just 20 days longer than Earth does. Number 10, Kepler 1649c. Scientists discovered Kepler 1649c after reanalyzing data from NASA's Kepler Space Telescope. The exoplanet was found to be similar in size to Earth in orbiting in its star's habitable zone. According to NASA, a computer algorithm mistook the astronomical body during the initial data collection from the telescope, but it was discovered to be a planet in 2020. Kepler 1649c is only 1.06 times the size of Earth and approximately 300 light years away. Scientists discovered that the exoplanet receives 75% of the light that Earth receives from the Sun when comparing to the light that the two worlds receive from their stars. Bonus Planet Trappist 1e The star is orbited by Trappist 1 and contains the greatest number of Earth sized planets ever detected in a single star's habitable zone. There are seven planets in this planetary system. According to previous reports from Space.com, the majority of these planets' water vaporized early in the system's creation. According to a 2018 study, several of these planets could hold more water than the oceans of Earth. Trappist-1e is regarded to be the world with the best chance of supporting life as we know it.